Hi everybody, my name is Jocelyn Hallman and I am the business liaison librarian here at CAPU. We were supposed to have an in-person library workshop this week, but unfortunately, obviously none of us are working, are coming to uh, class. So I wanted to put together a little bit of a resource for you to help you out with your change management reports for City Studio. I read through all of your interim reports and I was really excited to see a lot of the ideas that you guys were proposing. And um, I was thinking that probably the best use of our time would be to look at helping you guys find ways to bring some research into those reports in a couple of different ways. So the first thing I was thinking was that a lot of you had some really interesting ideas for what you would actually propose to go into the spaces that you were asked to address. And things like greenways, murals, um, different other kinds of public art projects, gathering spaces with interesting lighting, things like that. And I thought that it would be good for you to be able to find examples of other similar projects that have taken place in other cities or maybe even in Vancouver. Um, research that shows us what the, the urban planning or public planning process was around those things, um, details of what those projects were, um, and maybe some indicators of their success as well. And I thought that if you were able to insert some of that kind of research into your reports, it would really help make a case for why the proposal that you're making is a good idea. So that's one of the things I'd like to help you look at. Uh, the other thing is that I think you Many of you made claims in your reports as to why the kind of proposal you were making for what uh, the City of North Vancouver should do with those spaces would be helpful to the community. So some of you said it would create community, it would improve people's mental health, it would provide a gathering place, it would be a memorial. There's lots of different claims that you guys made about the benefits of the projects that you've proposed. And I thought that it would also be good for you to really bolster your arguments and your proposals if you could bring in research to support some of those ideas. So what I'm gonna do in these few short videos is uh, help you understand a little bit more about how to use the Capilano Library's website as well as Google to find those kinds of um, pieces of information. And um, then I'm also available as a consultant to you as well if you want to email me uh, with more about the project that you're doing and any specific issues you're having finding materials that you can bring into your reports. Um, I am working, generally speaking, Monday to Friday, so uh, I'm just working remotely. As you can see, I'm actually in my office. Nobody's here. I have two little kids, so it's really hard for me to work from home, um, but I'm available to help you guys out. So um, let's get started.